years on end, residents living near Black Mountain Elementary have been asking for changes to be made to Highway 33 speed limits in and around the school and the crosswalk here behind me, which is walked on every day by children and parents. But for all their attempts, it begs the question, what has to happen in order for things to change? All parents are really wanting it just to be clarified as a school zone, like everywhere else in town. 30 kilometers, you know, like slow down. There's kids everywhere and it's terrifying as a parent just to think that your kid is walking home and they may not be home when they're supposed to because they're hit by a car. Earlier this year, there was a boy hit on Loseth on a bike. He was crossing on a walking person and he got hit by a car. The woman went right through. Right now, it's only 50 kilometers when children are on a highway. And, but the sign right in front of it says 60 kilometers, so it's a very mixed message. And as you can see from standing here, people aren't doing 60. They're, they're flying by at at least 80 kilometers an hour, and there's kids crossing the street right now. Just this week, a woman who crashed her truck into a pole outside the school got close enough to nearly hit two young girls. We were walking home, and then we were standing like right over there, right over there, and then we were going to go across and the truck just crashed there and yeah. If it didn't hit that pole, it would have hit me and my sister. It's pretty scary, hey? Yeah. They're hoping the 30 kilometer per hour speed limit, which is enforced within the school zone, can be extended to the surrounding roads and that drivers will remember to slow down for everyone's sake. For Castanet News in Kelowna, I'm Laura Brooks.